1965 Toyota Land Cruiser interior. I'll show you. We do got new uh, new key cylinders. Really nice. You'll notice that it's easy to get in. All new uh, latches, strikers, catches, uh, new regulator on this side. Um, again, the felt and then the bug catcher uh, vents. Knob is new. Uh, showing you inside. Brand new uh, RS seats. These are actually super comfy, believe it or not. All Rhino lined inside here. Auto meter phantom gauges. Uh, these are cool. These are actually uh, uh, cup holder mounts. I just got to find them. I can't find them. I don't know what I did with them. Um, there's a temp gauge. There's your uh, interlock. Gear shift instructions, obviously, uh, that doesn't apply with the four speed uh, trans. So that's only good for uh, four wheel drive interface. Your passenger side, I'll go, I'll unlock that and show you on the other side. Here's your Cobra CB. It's all mounted up there clean with got the good uh, stainless clamps. And then the back, the top. Got some extra goodies in the back here. Whatever I have extra, I'll, I'll include with the uh, with the car. Latch. There we go. Just unlocked it for the other side. Do you have a uh, 12 volt on this side? We'll walk around to the other side here. Got some music for the background for you guys. And again, same thing. Felt, trim, latches, all that stuff. All new. The tank, like I said, the fuel tank. New, so you don't have to worry about that. Hardware for the hard top, new. Uh, a couple things that I do have to button up. Uh, I do have to make brackets to secure the top to the uh, tub and then I have to finish putting my hardware in the top there you'll notice that it's missing it's only uh, partially there and then obviously hang in the uh, windshield wipers so a couple small things but I'll get it handled before I before I uh, ship it out to the new owner <laughs> 